BSA stands for Birmingham Small Arms and we have Birmingham in the name of the company and which is why Birmingham is such a special place to us, uh, it's in our DNA. For us, it was also a very special place because it was where BSA motorcycles were first born. The most challenging part of this project was managing the geographies. People being located in various parts of the world. We had our design teams here in the UK, we had our uh, engineering teams in the UK, but we had our engine team, for example, based out of Austria. CLPL had a great idea to collect all the possible team members at the Motorbike Museum uh, in Birmingham. Uh, and, and here we were uh, seeing each other the first time and discussing what is the DNA of the, of the product. We also had some support back from the R&D Centre in India. So managing all of that and then came Covid. It really matters who you have on the uh, bus with you when you are on to such a wonderful and exciting journey. The relationships were amazing, primarily the bandwidth at which uh, we both interacted uh, in terms of our technical expertise and technical understanding. The intent was clear, we were making a classic retro. Keeping its heritage alive, uh, we wanted British engineers, British designers to work on it. Everyone's association for BSA is with a classic brand, so it didn't take long for us to hone down on the fact that we're not doing a brand new modern bike, it's a classic retro heritage bike. The aim was that this bike was going to be a um, bike full of character, so we're not aiming for high top speed, the fastest, 0 to 60, none of that, it's all about the character. The answer is very easy, my next bike in the garage will be exactly this bike. I definitely think we've answered the brief and produced an undeniably BSA look. To work on such an iconic project itself is a dream. Well, in all honesty, this is just the beginning. Uh, BSA has, has a long road to travel again. And uh, I'm so proud to be associated with it. Uh, actually honored as well uh, to have been able to play a part in the resurrection.